What is going on guys, Nick here, and in today's video, I'll be showing you how to make my camo that I created in the paint shop that is, I like to call the Rainbow Zebra. So as you can see here on screen, I have it on my RK5, and you can't cover the whole gun, unfortunately, but you can cover the about uh, the main part of the gun. So as you can see, it's right there. I'm going to go ahead and show it to you on another gun as well, and right here. And I might have one more. Yeah, the Cuda. So, as you can see, it's right there, the Rainbow Zebra. So, basically, what you're first going to want to do, it's a very, very simple camo to make. So, what you're going to need to do is go into the paint shop. Now, once you get there, you're going to select whatever gun you like to use it on. So, I'm going to go ahead and pick the M8. So, you're going to press Create New. And what you're going to start with to want to do is just grab the half tube shape and keep making it across the gun like this. So you're going to want to make it like this. Right, right there. And then you're going to press Y on it and then X and then pick two colors. So you want to pick two colors that are kind of like similar to each other. Like say orange and yellow. So there you go. There's the first color. So next you're going to want to copy, paste it. And then move it over a little bit and pick another two colors. So you're not going to use the same colors over again. So I'm going to use red and green. Now it doesn't have to look perfect only because you're going to be putting it under the zebra camo in any way. So it doesn't have to look like absolutely perfect because it will be, co be covered up a little bit. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, pick this blue color and now a darker blue right there now you don't have to do the same colors as I'm doing you just use whatever ones you think looks the coolest as you can see doing that press Y and then X pick the colors you want pick this one so basically what you're doing right now is just making a little bit of a tie-dye fade and then it'll be covered up so it'll look like rainbow at the end. Alright. Also guys, keep in mind that I probably will be posting more of these. I'm going to try to put one up every Friday. Uh, one of the, like a new camo video. <clears throat> and a tutorial on how I made it. And if you have any suggestions, be sure to leave it in the comments, and I'll definitely post a video about it, or whatever, depending on what it is, I'll post something. Or if you want, you could even send in your camo, and I'll make a video about it, and tell, show people what, what you guys made and stuff. So as you can see, we're almost at the end, and you're just going to keep picking whatever colors you like in this. So here we go. And we just have one more to do here. And I'm, I'm only going to be doing the one half of the gun. Otherwise, the video might be a little bit too long. Alright, so as you guys could see here, we finished the whole side of this gun. So now, once you finish this part, there's really nothing that hard to do all you have to do is go into patterns go down until you see tiger print yes I know it's tiger not zebra but it looks like zebra it looks pretty cool so what you're gonna wanna do is you're gonna wanna separate it into different parts of the gun like this so you could see the camo well and this is not a bunch of black lines so here you go just keep doing this copy and pasting it now one more time Alright, so there you go, guys. This is basically what it looks like when you finish. Now, you could do this with any guns you like, any colors. You could also do any patterns you like. I just think it looks really cool uh, with the rainbow and then the tiger print on top. But if you guys have any suggestions on anything else I should do, make sure you guys let me know. So, leave a like if you enjoy the video, subscribe for more content, and enjoy the rest of the gameplay.
Sweet harmony, in the sweet harmony. 